You're listening to YK Quick Tips, your guide to Yellowknife. Brought to you by WithMedia.ca, a truly northern podcast network. And YKOnline.ca, a hyperlocal blog all about Yellowknife. Well, hello and welcome to another episode of YK Quick Tips. That is right. This is the show. You can find it at ykquicktips.com or at ykonline.ca. That's where I am. And I am, of course, your host, Kyle With, And I am coming to you. I'm actually live right now. It's just doing this live. And speaking of live, that's going to be a bit about the topic today. Not so much live part, but how I'm doing this live. The internet. So the internet is basically where I live. It's a big open space. It's amazing. I love it. It's how I work. It's where I work. And it's hopefully where my career is going to lead me. But anyway, that's that has nothing to do with Yellowknife, you're thinking. But if, in fact, it does. If I'm going to do this, I need an ISP, an internet service provider. And they need to be decent. Do you know what I mean? So in the South, you have a lot of selection. You have a lot of, let's say, decent ISPs. Shaw, Rogers, Bell, Local Cable, whatever you have. Well, up here in Yellowknife, there really is only one main internet service provider, which is Northwest Tel. Now, I'd like to say that I'm not getting paid to say any of this. I'm just offering my... My the the knowledge that I have on who is decent, who should you know, who you might want to think about using. So, Northwest Tel is the one that owns all the pipes or whatever that are leading up into the north with internet, and so they offer their cable. And I believe they might actually offer DSL, but uh, I'm not too familiar on DSL. But they offer cable internet. They offer and it is relatively good speeds. The one thing that a lot of people from down south outside of Northwest ter- Territories ask me is, is there an, an unlimited bandwidth package? And I have to chuckle. There is no way that Northwest Tel is going to give anybody unlimited. There's no way that anyone in the north will ever give anybody unlimited. I mean, cell phone companies don't give anything unlimited, so why are ISPs? I don't know. So the most you can get, I believe the biggest package you can get on Northwest Tel at the moment is 60 gigabytes of bandwidth a month. And I that is what I have. The up and down speeds, I'm not too sure, but 60 gigabytes is what I have a month. And I have to say, as a heavy internet user, I do not use all 60. I come close and I will push it. I will push the limit, but I don't actually go over all the time. And I'm constantly watching videos online uploading and downloading photos and whatnot for ykonline.ca, but I have yet to hit that 60 gig limit myself. With the help of others, I have hit it, but that's I'm a heavy user when it comes to the internet. Another larger uh, internet service provider, although riding off the backbone of Northwest Tel, is SSI Micro. They offer a neat solution uh, for internet. They offer wireless modems. So... Basically, all you got to go do is go down there, sign up. They'll give you the wireless modem. You plug it in at home, turn it on, and it automatically connects to the internet or their internet in the air, whatever. They're broadcasting live around all of Northwest Territories or, or quite a bit of Northwest Territories in the larger populations. The downside to, Northwest, uh, to SSI Micro, although they're a great company, I do love them, but I do love the fact that they're wireless, but... The fact that they are wireless does create problems when it comes to uh, accessibility as to you have to have it located in your house where it can see out the window kind of thing. Uh, if there's too much activity around it, it's, it's finicky. As well as they do not offer as high bandwidth caps. I believe they are 20 gigabytes, and I could be even wrong, or there could be even less. And their up and down speeds are lower. But yet they are a still a competi- competitor to Northwest Tel, and they still are a decent choice if you are considering internet. If you're just a basic user and all you do is really check your email, check Facebook, then SSI Micro is great. It's fine. It's all you need. If you're heavier, you know, you, you do a lot more, then maybe you should consider something bigger. 
There are re- other resellers. Now, now remember that Northwest Tel owns everything coming into North, basically, internet-wise and phone-wise, I believe, but no one else is competing in the phone area. So SSI buys everything off of SSI. And then even one more step, a local company, a local business, Arctic Data, Arctic Data, in the lower YK Center, offers internet through SSI. So it's being resold twice before you actually get it. I don't know what the price does there, but it's something that you need to consider. My advice, my unbiased, I know I, there's positives and negatives to all of them. Go with it, Northwest Tell. They are the most reliable if you are looking for a lot of internet. Uh, as, as times progress, more and more people are doing more online and you need that bigger bandwidth cap. You, you, there's, not, there's just, you know, I, I, I thought about how I would approach this and say this, but I just can't think of a, I can't be fair or be the nice guy to everybody. They're great companies and there's nothing wrong with them. But Northwest Tel offers more, and it is it might it does spite start a lot of conversation, a lot of discussion around the north, as these guys have the control of everything. Why is there not another full on competitor with them? Why can't Shaw or Rogers come up here and try to, you know, get things going a little more? But it's the way it is right now. If you're moving up here, those are three options that I can think of right off the top of my head. Northwest Tel, which is the biggest suppliers, they're also the phone suppliers, so you can get phone and cables and digital cables, so you can get combos with that. And they are, um, I'm not actually sure where they're located, the, the green building in the downtown area. There's SSI Micro, which is on Old Airport Road, big sign that says SSI. Go in there, you, they'll help you out. Really nice building, really nice people. And Arctic Data, which is just a reseller of SSI Micro. They are in the lower level, the YK Center, and I don't know much more about them than that. There are other resellers out there. I don't know them as they're not that popular. You can Google around a little bit more, but chances are if I don't really know about them, they're not really going to be that great or not going to exist all that well. So those are my recommendations. If you have any other questions about about what they they offer, what they can do, let me know. Uh, a nice thing about all three is you can check your bandwidth limits throughout the month, see what you're doing uh, every day. Northwest Tel does one every day, or up, you're up and down, which is very helpful, and I definitely check it once a week, once every other week, just to make sure that I don't go over in a month so I don't get charged that $10 a gigabyte afterwards. So those are my thoughts on internet service providers in Yellowknife. If you have any questions about that or anything else please let me know you can send an email to info at yconline.ca and if you need to google any of them just google northwest tell ssi arctic data most of them have websites you can check those out i'm kyle with we'll see you next week